Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to go about resolving if you're having an issue with Windows Hello. And it says that Windows Hello is not available on this device. So this should hopefully be appreciated for process, guys. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to start off by opening up the Star Menu Search. Type in RegEdit, so R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best result, should come back our registry editor. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. And before you proceed in the registry, I would suggest you create a backup of it. So if anything were to go wrong, you could easily restore it back. In order to create the backup, it's very simple. All you have to do is select file and then export. File name, I recommend naming it the date in which you're making the backup. Set export range to all and then save it to a convenient and easily accessible location on your computer. And if you ever need to import it back in, all you'd have to do is select File and then Import and navigate to the file location. So again, pretty straightforward. And now we're ready to begin. So we're going to start by double-clicking on the HK Local Machine folder. So double-click on that. Do the same thing now for the Software folder. Double-click on that one as well. Should be a Policies folder. Double-click on that. Should be Microsoft. Double-click on that. Windows. Double-click on that one as well. And then there should be a system folder. Just left click on that one time. On the right side, you want to go ahead and create a couple of values here. If you need to pause the video at this point, take note of our file path. It's up at the top of the screen here. Each backslash is a different subfolder we've gone under to get to this point. And now on the right side, you want to right click in a blank area. Select New, and then select the word 32-bit value. You want to name this value Allow Domain Pin, P-I-N, Logon. All one word, the first letter of each word should be capitalized here, as you see on my screen. Again, allow domain pin logon. Go ahead and hit enter once you have that, as you see it on my screen. And now that you've done that, you want to go ahead and double click on it. Set the value data to 1. So delete the 0, type in number 1, and then select OK. Once you know what that, you can go ahead and close out of here. And you want to restart your computer. And there you go, guys. Hopefully, I was able to resolve your problem. If you're still having an issue and you're on Windows 11 Professional or higher, something else we can try here as well would be to open up the search menu. Type in Group Policy. Best result should come back with Edit Group Policy. Go ahead and open that up. And you want to expand Administrative Templates underneath where it says Computer Configuration. So up at the top, you want to expand Administrative Templates. And then you want to do the same thing for the System folder. Locate the logon folder on this list and go ahead and just left click on it. On the right side, you want to locate something that says turn on convenience pin sign in and double click on that. So once we're in here, you want to set this to the enabled position and then select apply and OK. Once you're done with that, you will need to again close out of here, restart your computer for the changes to take effect, and that should be about it. So again, I will actually restart the computer because some people. I don't know, I feel like I say you have to restart in order for it to take effect and people don't actually restart it even though I verbally say to restart your computer. So I'm going to visually restart our computer here. And there you go, guys. Hopefully that was able to resolve your problem. And as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. Do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.